All right, welcome to week two. We're finishing up week two of the legislative session. Um, I want to talk about this week, there's a lot of opportunities to come up and get engaged into your local politics and state politics. Throughout the session, I meet with a lot of constituencies and we have a lot of groups that come up here to advocate for various policies and, and things that they're concerned about. This week I went to a luncheon for the Women's Leadership Celebration and we celebrate a lot of the women leaders of the state. Um, I've also met with representatives and leadership from the Navajo Nation this week talking about some of their issues with, with tribal sovereignty and, and economic development on the reservation down in uh, southwest Utah. I um, met with the uh, South Valley Chamber Junior Women in Business and they were very uh, interested in social media bills and, and what we, the work that we did last year and what might be coming about this year and so uh, they're, they're a bunch of high school seniors that are uh, business champions and mentor with uh, other business leaders in our community. Um, met with uh, school choice rally in the in the capital and talked about the Utah Fits All program. The Sandy Rotary was here. I hosted them and, and spoke to them about legislation that's going on in the legislative process. Uh, also met with uh, various leaders of the local communities. Met with uh, Cottonwood Heights recently, uh, talked to the Draper mayor, um, met with the Sandy mayor, and we also met with Congressman Curtis and talked about some of the infrastructure projects going on there that can spur economic development, particularly in the Cairns district of Sandy. And then uh, last night also met with uh, members in our community that participate in the Legislative Coalition for Peoples with Disabilities. So uh, enjoy meeting with people, enjoy learning all their ideas and, and, and seeing what we can do to help with their particular projects and their particular concerns. In the Revenue and Taxation Committee this week, we talked about another tax cut. This is potentially the fourth year in a row that we'll do a pretty substantial income tax cut and that passed out of committee. Uh, this week we also talked about how Utah is becoming known for a sports community. We're talking about uh, NHL and MLB possibly coming here, obviously the Olympics. And so it's awesome that Utah is being recognized for all the good that we do and, and it's spurring economic development and the state's moving in the right direction. As always, please email me, text me. would love to visit with you up here at the Capitol as well.